So, a person in the conditional stage of material existence is in an atmosphere of helplessness. But the conditions show, under the illusion of maya or the external energy, thinks that he is completely protected by his country, society, friendship, and love, not knowing that at the time of death none of these can save him. This is karma. But he does not believe under the illusion of maya. He does not also believe that what is the meaning of saving. Saving. Saving means saving oneself from this repetition cycle of birth and death. That is real saving. They do not know. <coughs> the laws of material nature are so strong that none of our material positions can save us from the cruel hands of death. Everyone knows it. And that is our real problem. Who is not afraid of death? Huh? Everyone is afraid of death. Why? Because any living entity is not meant for dying. He is eternal. Huh? Therefore, birth, death, old age and disease, these things are botheration for him. Because he is eternal, he does not take birth, no jayate. And one who does not take birth, he has no death also. No mariyate, kadachi. This is our actual position. Therefore we are afraid of death. That is our natural inclination. So, to save us from death, that is the First business of humankind. We are teaching this Krishna consciousness movement for this purpose only. That should be the purpose of everyone. That is the Shastric injunction. Those who are guardians, the government, the father, the teacher, they are guardians of the children. Huh? They should know it, how to give protection to the world. Namo uh, So where is this philosophy all over the world? There is no such philosophy. This is the only Krishna consciousness movement which is putting forward this philosophy, not means it <coughs> But from authorized Shastra, Vedic literature, uh, authorities. So that is our request. We are opening different centers all over the world for the benefit of the human society that they do not know the aim of life. They do not know that there is next life after death. These things they do not know. That there is next life, undoubtedly, and you can prepare your next life. In this life, you can go to the higher planetary system, a better comfort, material comfort. Uh, you can remain here in a secure position. Secure means this material life. Uh, just like it is said, Janti Deva Prasad Devan, Pisri Janti Pisri Prasaha, Bhutani Janti Bhute Jya, Majjadi Nopi Janti Ma. So you can prepare yourself for better life in the heavenly planet 
or in a better society in this world, uh, or to go to the uh, planets where ghosts and other deities are controlling, or you can go to the planet where Krishna is there. Everything is open to you. Jansi bhūte ja bhūtāni madhyājino pi jansi ma. Simply you have to prepare yourself. Just like in your young youth life, they are educated. Somebody is going to be engineer, somebody is going to be medical man, somebody is going to be lawyer, and many other professional men. And they are prepared by education. Similarly, you can prepare for your next life. This is not difficult to understand, but they do not believe in the next life. Although it is very common sense. But actually there is next life, because Krishna says, and we can understand the philosophy by little intelligence, there is next life. So our proposition is that if you have got to prepare yourself for the next life, then why don't you take the trouble of preparing for going back to home, back to God? This is our purpose. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. 